news, everyone. I've sold Planet Express to Mom. <gasps> also, why are you wearing that funky hat? What? Oh, this? No reason. Hmm, that was odd. Mighty odd. Are you off your nut, Professor? How could you sell the company to Mom? I had to. We've been losing money. Perhaps my strategy of using a giant spaceship to deliver one package at a time wasn't as clever as I thought. Plus, you three never actually charged anyone. Yeah, sorry about that. Sorry. Ah, oh, this bends. Oh, fuff. It's not like this is the end of the world as we know it. This is the end of the world as we know it. With her recent purchase of Planet Express, evil entrepreneur Mob now owns over 50% of the Earth making her its supreme ruler. Has anyone ever noticed how Fry always seems to turn on the TV at just the right moment? At the risk of editorializing, this reporter applauds the demise of the pathetic human species. <laughs> <laughs> the situation is indeed grim. We go now to a live statement from Mom. Oh, don't worry, dearies. The only change I'm making is that Mother Earth will now be called Mom Earth. Ah, oh, that's cute. Also, you're all my slaves, and anyone who doesn't report for duty before curfew tonight will be blasted by Hoverbot Death Troopers. Okay, okay. In hindsight, maybe I shouldn't have sold her Planet Express. Must be my hind cataracts. Well, the Earth isn't safe anymore. As captain, I propose we get the hell out of here. Second. Amen, sister. To the ship. Oh, no. The ship's all wanged up. Who could have done such a thing? It wasn't me this time, I swear! No matter. We need to repair the ship, and we need to do it fast. Leela, you start banging on the control panel. I'm on it. Bender, you'll have to bend the ship back into shape. Man, how come I always have to do all the bending around here? And Fry, you, uh... What exactly do you know how to do? I can burp the alphabet. <coughs> A, B, D. No, wait. I've got a mission for you, Fry. Find a hammer. Yes, sir. Oh, what happened? You were crushed under two tons of debris. And you died! <laughs> it was so funny! <laughs> I guess you had to be there. I don't get it. If that's me dead over there, who am I here? You're also you, thanks to my latest invention, the Reanimator. Every time you die, it will automatically make an exact duplicate of you based on your x-rays, a DNA sample, and some scrapings from the inside of your tennis shoes. Wow. When did you invent it? About a week ago. And I've been trying to kill you to test it ever since. So what was death like, Fry? Well, first everything went dark. Then this bright light appeared, and it said, Game over. Oh, Professor, here's the hammer I died getting for you. You are? Oh, you can keep that piece of junk. I only made you look for it to get you out of my metaphorical hair. Now, if you want to look for some tools I actually need, why don't you find the ones missing from my tool rack? Okay, which ones are missing? All of them. They're all in the building somewhere, and I can't fix the ship without them. Can you find them and put them back? No problem -o. You wonderful. All my tools are back in place, even the ones I didn't need. Ones you didn't need? Oh, sadly, though, there was one part I was unable to repair. Not the dark matter engine, not the dark matter engine. The dark matter engine. Ah, crap. But don't we have a backup engine? We did, but we never used it. It being backup and all, so I pawned it. You p pawned it? 
Why? For the same reason everyone pawns everything in America. To get a gun. Okie dokie, Fry. Go to the pawn shop and get back our engine. But there's a curfew. Hoverbot death troopers are roaming the street. Ah, yes. Then you'll have to take the sewers. But, but, but what about the sewer mutants? I gave you a gun. What do you want, a flowered dress? Now stop being a wussy and get going. Does this casing make me look fat? Stop asking me that. So, uh, how was your power downtime? Great, but you know, toward the end of it, I was itching to get back to work. I know I'm supposed to like robot women, but sometimes, well... You like human women? No, robot men. Oh. <clears throat> Why use my own legs like an idiot when I can use a chicken walk? Hey, I heard you were coming. I got your engine right here. All right!